Okay. Uh, <coughs> Rafa. Uh must feel great relief. Our, our number one city player is in the final because of two retirement in a row. Uh, is this an advantage or disadvantage in your opinion? Uh doesn't matter. No. That's my opinion. <laughs> Russian? Yes. Because, because I said I was told that you're allowed to question in English or Russian. So okay. 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 So uh, you played uh, two short games. Uh, the last two matches were short, and Nikolai Lodinka played a three-hour game today. How do you think it's important to do this? Uh, we are ready to, to compete three hours and to, to play uh, next day, no? so I think that that's not going to be a problem for Nikolai, especially because he's a very good kid. No? Um, I think it's more advantage, advantage than disadvantage, no? because when the match like he, he did today is it's very good news for him and it's a lot of confidence for him. And she was in the match playing really well and you know, they with big confidence right now. So. Uh, she described you as a more defensive player, player than Lansanis or Djokovic. Should we expect a very defensive game tomorrow? Hmm. Uh, well... I don't think I am more defensive than. Well, probably more than Djokovic, but not than Gonzalez, no. Gonzalez uh, uh, have a big forehand, but with the bag and he played defensive all the time. And, uh, and, uh, right. no, but anyway, uh, doesn't matter the comparison now. But uh, offensive or attacking, I'm gonna try my best. You know, uh, if I have the chance to attack, I'm going to attack. If I want to attack, I'm going to attack. If not, I'm going to defend. I'm going to do uh, all in my hand to try to win. If I think the, the way to win is defense, I'm going to defend. And if I think the way is attack, I'm going to attack. So, you know, the, the, the sport is not a mathematic thing. Uh, after the difficulties you have had this year, particularly um, with your knees earlier in the year. Have you thought yet about the schedule for next year? And have your doctors advised you what sort of schedule you should play next year? Well, if you give me... I don't know, no, but... Uh, you see a different option to do or not? Because I, I don't see. You know, the, 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 the way can change the way. Uh, probably, you can do it different things. If you want to, to only play uh, the forest lands and the uh, master series or or try to be ready to compete to be in the top position and try to be ready to compete well in this tournament. No? Uh, I have problems this year, but remember for the last five years I, I had a big results in a lot of important tournaments. And the calendar, probably, probably in 2005, I played more than, than using the rest of the players. But to generalize my calendar this year, I played one tournament to, to prepare Australia. I played all in Rotterdam. Well, no, I in Wales, Miami, and I played uh, Wales, in, uh, in, in, play, uh, uh, in Barcelona. And Barcelona, uh, Barcelona, me, Barcelona I, I had to play Barcelona. Well, uh, no, no, but uh, that's true. No, it's a 500 on clay. It's the only one what I can play on clay. 
Later I I can play in Roland Garros. One week on grass to prepare Wimbledon. Uh, and later yes, uh, I have one month out to to prepare another time. From the Toronto Cincinnati and US Open. And that's the schedule. And that's the calendar. That, that's not my schedule. That, that's the obligatory calendar. calendar you have to be ready in the, in the, in the That's my feeling. Uh, I don't see no other options for. That's what I. That's what I'm gonna try to do. Thank you.